Tonight, an apology to the sub-postmasters and mistresses wrongly convicted in Scotland. Now, a man has gone on trial accused of murdering Emma Caldwell almost 20 years ago. The naked body of the 27-year-old was found in woods in South Lanarkshire in 2005. 51-year-old Ian Packer is also accused of sexually assaulting 27 other women. He denies a total of 46 charges, including 11 counts of rape dating back to 1990. Our Home Affairs correspondent David Cowan reports. That report by David Henderson. Well, Maria Hewitt is a nurse who worked on the COVID wards during the pandemic and she lost her police officer husband, John, to the virus. Earlier, I asked her how she felt about the UK inquiry coming to Scotland to hear evidence. Lots of submissions today, just the, the start of things really here. Uh, the inquiry heard that there were some significant differences on how the UK and the Scottish governments handled pandemic advice. Would you agree with that, just, just from, from your all kind of done the same thing. Now, your husband, John, was a, a police officer and there was a submission today, a brief one about policing. Police encounters were said to be the, the last resort, really, to, to prevent transmission during the pandemic. And the data that they submitted said around 88% of all encounters were able to be resolved without enforcement, so without police officers coming into contact with people. What are your thoughts on how frontline officers like your husband, John, um, were protected during that? This inquiry is going to hear from former ministers, Jean Freeman, Hamza Youssef, former health secretary, Nicola Sturgeon, of course, first minister during the pandemic. What, what do you hope to hear from them? The relative to make that choice, we shouldn't have. Okay, well, Maria, we're really grateful to you oh, for coming. Amy. OK, let's uh, stay on sport as we head to the world premiere of Six Nations Full Contact. The Netflix documentary series takes viewers behind the scenes of last year's rugby tournament with the first episode focusing on the Scotland team. Well, who better to send down to the red carpet than our entertainment reporter Jodie McCallum, who has had a crash course in the rules of rugby. Right, a quick review for the pie, because yes. you had a pie after yes, we spoke so I may, to Alan. I may or may not have had a pie for dinner tonight. <laughs> uh, it was very nice. Like Alan says, though, um, you know, other Scotch pies are available Absolutely. and there's lots of fantastic competition out there. Mm, I'm having one for supper, I think. Mm. Now let's go to the awards uh, season in LA and to Succession. The hit TV show about the dysfunctional family of a media mogul played by Scotland's Sir Brian Cox took six awards, including Best Drama, for the third time at last night's Emmys. Elsewhere, the comedy drama The Bear also picked up six awards and Sir El Southern areas. That's the forecast. Back to you both. Kirstine, thank you so much. Stay warm and we will see you tomorrow at nine. Bye-bye. Good night.